Tonight, a somber birthday. Dozens of Cornelius community members gathered to honor Madalena Kojikari on her 12th birthday. The young girl was last seen on November 21st, but her parents didn't report her missing until three weeks later. Thanks for joining us here at 10 tonight. I'm Morgan Francis. Queen City News Northeast Bureau Chief Sidney Heiberger was there as the police chief gave his first public remarks to the media and tells us what new information we learned. The chief kept most things close to his chest, saying he did not want to jeopardize the investigation. But he did say that before Diana Kojikari reported her daughter missing, police were called to their home because Diana was seen burning furniture in her backyard. A birthday without much celebrating. Dear Jesus, while our hands and arms can't touch Madalena today, we pray and trust that your protective arms are fully embraced around her. April 11th marked Madalena Kojikari's 12th birthday and also 141 days since she was last seen getting off her school bus. We always keep hope. You know, we pray for Madalena every day. We pray for her in our meetings. We pray for her when we get together as a group, along with every child that's going through a tough situation. Cornelius Police has not released much information regarding Kojikari's disappearance. In fact, for almost every question we asked at their first media briefing on Monday. I can't comment on any of those specific to this time. A story that's touched everyone in this community, some with stories of their own. I lost my daughter. 32 years ago in a bus wreck. She was 12. So I just, just my heart breaks for families that are, their children are missing. And for Madalena's classmates, many of them just 12 themselves, a void felt in her absence. I just want her to come back to her house and to like this community safe. Police have tied yellow ribbons outside their department and on their patrol cars to honor Madalena on her 12th birthday. The police chief said that he still believes someone out there has information about what happened to Madalena. Reporting in Cornelius, Sydney Heiberger, Queen City News.